right through the eye one more what is going on you beautiful human being welcome back to my channel today we're reacting to attack on titan episode 27 called i'm home if you like attack on titan smash that like button follow my channel if you yo! want to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you stay up to date let's jump into this so yo we had a crazy last episode I was literally speechless by what happened. And even when I was editing, I was like, oh my gosh, I forgot about this part. I forgot about this part. There's so much that actually happened. But the biggest thing was that abnormal titan or something busy talking and even the other part where they were saying like, oh, this is 12 hours before, you know, I think it was what 12 hours before. I, see, I can't even remember, but it was just crazy. And then we had these, like, some, I mean, appearance, I guess you would call them. And they, like, listened to this abnormal titan. And he literally took one of their maneuver gears to go study it. But the thing that was interesting is that he spoke about it in a way that was kind of like oh you guys use you guys know that we're in the nape like he spoke about them like you know he spoke about it like it was completely separate like i don't know how you guys live and you don't know how we live and now i'm figuring this out titans have been spotted we actually haven't seen pixis in a long time Damn, so that's the other thing, right? It's like, you know, it really is crazy. Like, the walls are made of titans. So, like, how does that even, like, just flips everything on its head? Like, how, is, how did the walls even get made in the first place? You know, it was kind of like had me thinking in terms of what if like titans protected human beings from other titans to begin with and so they made the walls to protect humanity or did they use it as a way to sort of to keep them prisoners and then the humans built the gates pastor nick the rat Oh, so they're forming a new team with Armin, Eren, and Mikasa. And once again, I feel like Commander Erwin knows more than he leads on. That's what I was just saying. Has Titans been protecting them from Titans? Or have they been keeping them prisoners? It's crazy. It's mad. Like, you never know what to predict in the show. I've predicted many things, but there's just more that you don't know. Oh, so they're gonna show him what it's like. Like, with real titans. I swear I busted my knees somehow. It's super sore. Headache. Oh, right. <laughs> Bro, his ankle snapped. Oh, so the I'm home is probably because Sasha is going back to her village now. <laughs> Always a beast for food. <laughs> He's almost got an accent like, you know, like a, a southerner from America. It's because more people be coming. You know what I mean? If you had to read it in that way. 
but it makes sense now when you see in the beginning where she was eating the potato when they were doing the name calls like it makes sense to see what a disconnect there is oh titan footprints it makes sense to why there was such a disconnect between her and other people because she's literally from like a village in the forest Man, and the Titans already been through this, so like, what is she really gonna find? A new village! Holy smokes! And this all took three years, is that what, basically, that's what they're saying? Oh my gosh, there's a Titan in there. A five meter by the looks of it. What is this? Cannibals! Bro, what is going on? Oh my gosh. What? Look how small the titan is. Bro, this is crazy. First it looked like a... Like a, a man. Just a normal guy. And look how skinny it is as well. But the one, the one that they, that she saw on the path had bigger footprints though. Oh my gosh. There's no need to worry and she's completely panicking. Oh my gosh. She doesn't have a sword, that's why she couldn't cut through the neck. Then this child is completely petrified. Okay, let's go, Sasha. But I mean, what's really, what's a bow and arrow really gonna do? But, you know, it'll definitely slow it down. Or maybe. Damn, the movement. Come on, but you gotta hit the, you gotta hit your target. Oh, right through the eye. One more. Oh. Let's go, Sasha. <laughs> right through the eye. Crazy. Oh, my word, she got caught. Damn. And it can't heal because I mean the arrows are still in there. Is that Reiner? Oh, it's oh the people from the past. But I wonder who that is though. Is that her dad or something? <laughs> Who'd have thunk it was you? It is a father. Crazy. I'm home. Alright, oh, because Connie's going to his village now as well. But it looks completely destroyed. Damn, and that's the thing, like, both of them going back to their homes and look at the different states of it. Oh my gosh. What is that? Is it dead? Why does it look like it's lifeless? How did it even get you? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 
that now my brain is starting to think about something else like is that the, qu the biggest question still is how are these titans made yes we get the other ones where people transform into them into them but i think in the very beginning i was saying that you know maybe like they transform normal human beings into that somehow i don't know so what if that is someone that he knows that maybe got injected with something and then like they transformed into that and now they've just been stuck there the whole time because obviously it couldn't be dead because they literally like dissipate and they disappear once they get killed so i don't think and they said they don't have stomachs or something so they don't like they don't actually need to eat to survive but it's funny because both of the titans that we saw in the two villages were like a lot skinnier than the ones we had known from before which was very interesting but that was the episode decent episode we kind of delve into you know sasha's backstory just slightly of how you know she was actually against helping other people helping society she just wanted to live her life in the forest there hunting and stuff and even though the people had lost their homes she still didn't want to be a part of that and that's kind of what her dad was trying to explain to her now seeing three years later how she actually became that that her dad wanted to see you know actually helping someone else and that's why he was surprised to see that a lot more questions though just them all discussing the fact that you know the t the walls are made of titans that's the thing that's crazy and then armin posed the question like have titans been protecting us from titans this whole time so there's so much that they don't know obviously this war has been happening for such a long time you don't even know how it started or where it started i'm sure we'll be slowly moving towards that and like past the nick he even knows about it when he's been quiet the whole time they're kind of keeping him along taking him along with but he still won't speak so that's why hanji was like look here like threatening him doesn't help but if we show him what's happening out there maybe we'll get some answers so they're actually taking him beyond the wall very good though other than that just like i said there's always more and more questions like like i said you you at some point you think you know what's happening and then it changes and obviously i wanted to see more about this abnormal titan you know the one that looks like the the bigfoot yeti but i'm sure that'll start to come up later obviously when Mitch or Miche died like what he saw died with him so someone else will have to find out and figure that out but anyways really good episode that's going to be it for me if you like attack on titan smash that like button follow my channel if you Yo! want to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you stay up to date because you know i'm releasing every single day of the week i'm gonna leave the last episode right up over here thanks for watching if you're watching i'm out peace in a bit